Sterot's residents are in self-preservation mode. Half of the town's businesses are shuttered, schools are closed, residents have fled, and the few locals venturing away from blast-proof protective rooms are mostly stocking up on goods or they're resigned to their reality. Where am I supposed to go? China? Who needs me over there? Where will I go? Tel Aviv? Things happen there too. Not Qasem rockets, but stabbings. One kilometer away in Gaza, the same tense quiet and virtual shutdown. After two days of intense Israel airstrikes on Gaza and Islamic Jihad rocket fire on Israel, there's talk of an Egyptian brokered ceasefire. But defiant government statements cast doubt. We choose the time and place to hit you. We choose, not you. Sterot residents have heard the tough talk before. In the more than 20 years Gaza has fired mortars and rockets on Israel, Sterot has been hit hardest. People in this town are fed up with their crippled economy and stress-filled lives, but they don't envision a lasting solution to the ongoing warring. One minute it's heaven here, the next it's hell. We've shouted, but it falls on deaf ears. They don't listen to us, we're second class. So they wait for word of ceasefire, knowing it will be temporary, like all the other ceasefires drawn up throughout the years. Stephanie Fried, CGTN, Sterot, Israel.